What's up guys, this is my quick video for the Google Maps update for iOS 8. So this is a new update that changes the UI and the icons and all the things in the Google Maps. You got new locations for the features, for all the tasks and things to do. You got here all the information, you got to report a problem, you got the rule, you got save and share option up here. So Google Maps are changed, I mean they are different from they looked earlier, but this update is more nicer you got the my location you got the route up there you got the search bar and i have up here you got all this stuff like traffic public you got satellite google earth so you're gonna need to download google earth and google earth doesn't support all the globe so if you're china asia or africa you won't be getting google earth because of some reasons secondly guys the one i like is the traffic because you can know from which way the traffic is actually coming so you got the sign in you can also save your custom addresses like your office address your home address so that's an update and if you swipe up to the other direction you can click on that tab to make your direction toward north so you already got the search bar you can search anywhere and these search results are actually pretty much fast as compared to the last version of google maps so here we got got the traffic up here the green yellow and red you got a big band but the problem with the google maps is that if you are in satellite mode you can't get the 3d effect like the apple maps do so you're gonna need to turn off to your satellite maps and go back to normal maps to get that go to get that 3d effect with your map so that's a problem that i think but is that much different because you do get the google street inside it so you got you got the 3d effect of the big bed and all the surrounding middlings of big bed but that's in i mean that's in transparent color and that doesn't stand out like good i mean here we got all the globe up here so another feature that i do like about is the terrain feature in terrain feature we get all the different terrains like mountains plateaus plains deltas all this stuff is still present all the tributaries all the stuff and i do like the terrain more than the satellite more and here we got it so yeah the color i like the satellite more but this thing does stand out in desert more so i do like this thing and the third thing that is new is the save option you can save maps for offline reading if you're out somewhere and you don't have maps so you can just do it he got the cell mode and if you are in a location like near your house or something like that you get all of these like eat drink play you got the more option up here so you can just search up for places to eat places to sleep for playing for gyms for drinking for eating for shopping everything is still present in this thing which was a copy from the apple maps i do think and if you're interested to save some location like here we got the address he says save this map you're gonna need to click on the save button at the bottom and you can just save it as a name like home i'm gonna it's my home address up here you click on the save button and your address would be saved it says map saved so you can just access this map up from your account and i'm going to offline mode i've turned my wi-fi off going up here you can just go scroll down and go save offline maps home click on that and you're good to go map just get open and this just work for satellite map also so you can get a good view of your address or any places or interest you got accounts folder up here so all your youtube gmail accounts will be synced with this map so that's another thing but this thing is great you can just transfer from device to device so we got search libraries bus stands and all the things is present in this application this update is more better than the last update but this update doesn't confuse a 3d effect a google earth effect so that thing isn't great but still guys this is a great thing because searches are too fast i mean they will like a millisecond and faster than the apple maps you get your direction all over the globe that apple doesn't provide so there are many things that are good by google maps and there are many things that are bad by them but still i love google maps i use it on my main home screen except using the apple maps until then peace guys